Aha! Do you remember me? I'm a drop. I'm meeting you now after chapter 3. How are you? Ah, see, there's a garden. Come, let's go for a stroll in it. Here, the gardener is watering the plants. See how the flowers are blossoming. Oh, but see, these flowers planted along the road are wilting. Do you know why? There is no one to water these flowers. They are waiting for the rains. These trees you see along the road, there is no one to water them as well. They too wait for the rains. Shall I tell you a secret? It is about to rain in a while. These flowers and trees would be very happy today. Children, where do animals drink water from? Wild animals quench their thirst at lakes or ponds. Here too, rains are important. After all, it is rain water which fills up many lakes and ponds. Street animals which live in the city do not always have access to rivers and ponds. They lap up water from puddles, drains, etc. Have you ever wondered where do the dogs, cats and birds around you get water? Won't it be wonderful if we kept a bowl of water outside our houses for these animal friends? Oh wow! It has started raining! Everything looks so beautiful, doesn't it? Let's look at the sky. Whenever it rains, the sky undergoes several changes. The blue sky gets covered with dense clouds. When clouds are about to send forth rains, they turn dark. Sometimes a streak of lightning accompanies the rain. When the sun peeps out from the sky while it is raining, a rainbow can be seen. The arrival of rains make trees, plants and animals very happy. Can you guess who else becomes happy when the rains arrive? Farmers. Many farmers depend upon the rains for a healthy crop. Rains sometimes also lead to many problems. Can you guess how? Think of the farmers children. If it rains too much or it rains off the weather, the crops can get damaged. Rains can destroy kacha houses. People who live on roads and footpaths in the cities are especially affected by the rains. Also, rains lead to damage of roads, formation of puddles and long traffic jams. Oh, the rain has stopped. Look, Radha and Ravi have came out from their house along with a paper boat. Do you know how to make a paper boat? If yes, then make one and set it sail in rainwater. And then revise our conversation of today. Today we learnt about the rains. We saw how important they are for plants, trees and animals. We also learnt that farmers are dependent on the rains. The sky undergoes many changes when it is about to rain. One can see lightning and rainbows along with clouds when it is raining. People can also face some problems because of rains. Children should especially be careful to not get wet in rains, otherwise they may fall ill. Alright, I have told you much about rains and I will go now.